Well, on Fridays, we have our high school red zone kickoff presented by Dave Edwards. And this morning, we are at Crescent High, where the Tigers will host 96. Cover your ears because Christine <laughs> Scarpelli and photographer Ryan. Oh, now they're quiet. Oh, this is yeah. the first time they've been yeah. quiet all morning. I She's knew live you'd in say Iva. That. I knew it. No, I knew you'd say that. So we just decided to throw you off a little bit. You did. You guys are paying attention. Listen, we got to keep you awake in there. No trouble doing that this morning, though. We've got Crescent High School looking great first thing in the morning. Check out those hashtags, too, guys. I think we should be using those all morning on our social media. I don't know. I got some really, really fun things to tell you about. I'm so impressed, first off, that all these guys are out here looking so great and in their Hawaiian garb. Check out the sea and the paw print. Real creative, too. They're facing off against 96 tonight. It's going to be a big game. They're both 2 and 0. Oh, so, who is going to go home with that L? Not these guys, if you listen to them this morning, glad to hear from Emily first off. Student Council, a huge part of this school, but also adopting a teacher? What is that? Well, the teachers always take such good care of us, so we decided oh. that it was time that we take care of them. <laughs> so, what each, does that look like? Each student, they pick a teacher and they adopt them for the mm -hmm. school year. We present them a certificate and we check up on them throughout the year and we tell them about our upcoming events so they can participate. Wow, keeping them in the loop. I like that. We have Coach Brown, Mr. Brown here this morning, the girls' varsity basketball coach. He is uh, repping them this morning, talking about them all morning. I can't get him to stop. First, though, I got it. Look at this. <laughs> Mr. Brown, do you enjoy being adopted? Who's your, I guess, who's the person adopting you? Well, first of all, I absolutely love being adopted. And I have here Mr. Reagan Hendricks. He is the one that takes care of me during the school year and makes sure that I'm up to date on things that are going on throughout our school year. Like what? I know you guys have a lot going on. We do have a lot, and there are a lot of fun things. So if anytime there's a pep rally going on, he'll stop by my room to remind me that uh -huh. there's a pep rally. If there are a special event where the SGA may be hosting something and I want to take a part in that, he also lets me know and get me information as that for that. As well. He's like your handheld planner. We love that. Do you feel like it's working? Absolutely. Oh, all right, Reagan, what do you think about uh, adopting Mr. Brown here? He's a very good coach and he always encourages us to do our best. Encouragement. Listen, that's not easy to do, guys. Constantly encouraging is a great thing. We give you, pr I appreciate what you're doing with oh, these kids. Thank you. Thank you. Guys, can we give him a round of applause at the station? He's so great. You guys love Mr. Brown. <laughs> Let me hear. Are you clapping in there? I hope so. I hope you're clapping. Uh, next, let's show maybe our anchors how loud you guys can be. Do you think we should uh, hear that this morning? Let's go, guys. Let's hear it. What do you think about that, Fred? There Julie it is. Huff? There's that That's noise. That's what we were waiting for. That'll wake you up. <laughs> yeah, uh, they're bringing it. We love it. Yeah. Thanks, Christine. We'll see you next hour. Tell them to kind of save some of that energy. Yeah. 553, we're bringing it.